Have you ever been on an escalator? I'm going to take this one to get to the floor below. And to get on an escalator safely, you have to wait for a step to appear, hold onto the handrail, and then quickly step on. Let's go. Now, can you see that I'm stood still, but I'm somehow moving? That's because the escalator is moving downwards and it's carrying me to the floor below. You should never play on an escalator, but I've got special permission to take a closer look. Can you see how the steps just disappear here at this metal yellow edge? It looks a bit like a comb, doesn't it? The steps go underneath and disappear. But where do they go and where do the steps come from? Well, to find out, we need to look inside and underneath an escalator. Inside an escalator, the stairs are linked together in one big loop. It moves round and round. The stairs are attached to two sets of wheels called gears, one at the top and one at the bottom. The gears at the top of the escalator are called round bike chains. They look a bit like a bike chain. The gears at the bottom run along a track like a train. The gears have teeth on them and when they turn, they pull the loop of stairs around with them. Each step has small wheels on it. When a step reaches the top, the chain pulls the wheels around the gear until the step is flat again. It stays flat until it gets all the way back to the bottom, ready to go round again. Aren't escalators interesting? This is an escalator workshop and we've got special permission to be here so that we can see what the underneath of a real life working escalator looks like. I'm going to use my special camera and a light to look underneath the escalator and see what we can find. Let's start by reminding ourselves what the steps actually look like. The curved bit is the side of the step and then the flat bit is the top. But now let's move underneath. This escalator is switched off so I can safely put my camera underneath. Here you can see the underside of the steps that you stand on. Can you see the curved side and the flat bit on top? And if we can see even further underneath here, that is where the steps are lying flat, ready to make their way back to the gear to be looped around. So we need to see the gear, don't we? And this is the gear at the top of the escalator. It looks a bit like a giant bike chain, doesn't it? 